What's up, guys? Welcome to another exciting episode of Pump It Up with your host, Captain Fucking Canada, the Hendo. Uh, this is actually going to be kind of a quick story time, but right now I'm going to pause for my intro. All right, what I wanted to bring up is the whole point of my channel is to motivate and inspire, but sometimes I got to call bullshit for bullshit. And the reason for that is, you know, I'm 45 years old, okay? I've got two serrated vertebrae in my back. Um, I was in a car accident. My knees went through the dashboard, and I couldn't walk about 15 years ago. I'm back to normal. I work out every day. Doctors told me I need double carpal surgery, carpal tunnel surgery. I still get around, still do everything at work. Demo, sandblast, uh, lay brick, load concrete, finish concrete, whatever. Whatever. It is what it is. Somebody came up to me the other day and he's like, man, I'm old. And I'm like, you are. Obviously, he didn't know my age. And I said, how old are you? He's like, I'm 36. Okay. He's like, yeah. He's like, uh, you don't know this, but I used to be a power lifter and a bodybuilder. I was a power lifter for like 10 years and a bodybuilder for like 10 years. And uh, my body's all beat up. I was like, Okay. I kind of walked away. Life, it's not what you used to be. And the fact is, unfortunately, if you have to go around telling people what you used to be, you probably never was, is more like it. First thing I think of is when somebody tells me I used to be bigger than you, or I used to be this, or I used to be that, is do you have a Facebook? <laughs> How come there's no pictures of it? Um, my point is not to take apart anybody that really does that in a way, but but here's what I, I've noticed with people. People come up to me all the time and say, I'm not like you, Jeff. I can't do that. Okay? And... They'll give me excuses like, oh, my elbow, or oh, my back, or oh, my knees. You know, it's true. Everybody does have a different pain threshold, okay? But in life, I think here in the States, we coddle people a little bit too much and give them excuses. And I'm not a big excuse person. I'm more of a doer. In other countries, there are people that are born without legs, that do incredible feats and they don't say I can't do that because I don't have legs there I've seen guys on Facebook that do in fucking incredible things some of our vets do incredible things after they lose their limbs okay and they're fucking heroes okay you're not a fucking hero when you're going around for no reason making excuses you're a fucking excuse okay so it's kind of a rant, but there's a positive end to the means, okay? You can do something now. You can change. You can be effective. You don't have to be an excuse because when you go up to somebody and you tell them, I used to be something, you're qualifying yourself as nothing to everybody around you. So don't live in what never was. Live for now, get out there and do something. I hope this video helps. I'm Maddie, I need to do fucking cardio. Mm -hmm.